I want to convey my heartfelt thanks to all of those businesses up and down the country which are working to keep our economy going. Supply chains and those managing them have had to adapt to the pandemic in record time. With customer behaviour changing overnight, it was essential that supply chains could adapt to changing customer needs while also keeping the people on the front line safe. Social distancing measures are in place across the site at all times. This started with being able to stay operational. All business critical staff were thoroughly trained in new protocols to ensure DHL's vital work could continue. I came back to work. I adopted the attitude that I've got a new job rather than coming back to my old job because that way you think yeah. about things freshly. Yeah. But it seems to be working. Yeah. And how about the truck? I'm a bit of a clean freak anyway, so mine's right. always clean. Yeah. But uh, yeah. you keep your space clean and you'll be okay at the end of the day. Have you got everything you need? Oh, there's cleaning and sanitising equipment abound. I mean, I've got three bottles of sanitizer in my cab. I've seen a real cultural change in the last eight to ten weeks since we started implementing all the one-way systems, the distancing measures, the sanitizing stations, the wash stations, everything we're doing to keep our colleagues safe. The warehouse is in place, the one-way system and how everybody's come back from furlough and has been following. It's been difficult but it's become in place and we've got our champions with the purple and yellow hivises to help us, remind us that we need to follow the one-way system. The coronavirus pandemic has proved to be DHL supply chain's biggest ever challenge in the UK. In these unprecedented times, with customer behaviour changing beyond recognition, robotics and AI more crucial than ever, a more streamlined operation has emerged, one that will be more resilient to meeting future needs. What the COVID-19 period has taught us is our amazing ability to adapt our operations to what our customers need, to do in five days what may have taken us five weeks previously, whether that's building ventilators in some of our auto facilities or setting up COVID testing kits from scratch. As I look forward, the really key requirement is that we continue to help our customers deal with the uncertainties of this post-COVID trading period. DHL redesigning and improving existing operations and working with customers to reimagine what the supply chain will look like into the future.